What's up everybody, welcome to today's video. Um, today is going to be a little bit different if you watch my uh, daily vlog channel. Um, today is going to be just an unboxing video of the Canon Rebel T6i Video Creator Kit. Um, I'm going to be unboxing it and um, I've been waiting a long time for this camera. If you're anything like me, I've just, you're just searching through a bunch of these videos, unboxing videos, trying to find the best one possible. I've been researching this camera for at least seven or eight months now, so I know a lot about this camera, um, so you've come to the right place. And um, yeah, I'm going to be reviewing it and um, maybe taking a little test run with it and stuff like that. So um, yeah, um, let's get right into the unboxing and uh, a little bit of the review. All right, so we're going to unbox it right here. Um, just a really quick look at the box if you wanted to see it. I thought it was more of like a, a square, but it's, I think it's, it's more of a rectangle. I thought it was more of a square when I was looking at all the unboxing videos. So um, it's more of a rectangle box. Um, here's just some of the things up here. It shows the uh, camera, the kit, 18 to 55 millimeter lens. Um, Rode Video Mic Go, 32 gigabyte SD card. I'll be talking about that as I'm unboxing it as well. Um, here's another thing in the box. There's with the uh, Rode Video Mic Go on there. Um, this one has the flip out screen. Bottom of the box just shows you some of the stuff that comes with it, stuff like that. Um, I think that's all the sides. Um, so I'm gonna unbox this baby right here. I'm super stoked about it. I have, I've been waiting for this unboxing for a long time, so um, it's gonna be awesome. Little flap here. There we go, there it's open there. And then we take this, whatever side. It up. There we go. All right, so I know I didn't really like listening to this part, but uh, we got just some of this really like just stuff that tells you a little bit more about what you can get with the camera. Which I, I never, I never use this stuff. I'm throw it to the side for now. Um, if we open this up, this has all the things, all the beauties in it. So let's move this box off to the side for now this in the frame. Um, as you can see here, it's got the camera down low, the road video might go on the top, and the uh, SD cards I believe is on, it's somewhere, I think it's on top of this thing, on the road video mic so go, so, uh, and there we go, all right. Yes, I was right. Um, here we have the 32 gigabyte SanDisk SD card, Ultra, um, if you wanna just pause the video right there to see those tech specs of this SD card. Uh, it runs for DSLRs and stuff like that. Um, here we got, not not for resale, okay. Uh, here we got the Rode Video Mic Go. It is a lot bigger than I thought. Um, so uh, if that's just another thing, it's a little bit bigger than I would have um, liked it to be. I mean, obviously the camera's big too, but uh, yeah, there's just a little bit more. If you wanna pause the video or something, look at that. Um, but uh, yeah, here it is in the box. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm gonna take that out after I unbox the actual camera. Here is the beauty itself, the Canon Rebel T6i box. Um, I'm literally like shaking. This is, this is awesome. I literally have been waiting so long for this. Uh, I'm gonna unbox the uh, the Rode Video Mic Go first, just because I want to save the best for last and. Uh, so yeah, let's unbox this little contraption here. And this this Rode Video Mic Go uh, does not require batteries, which is actually awesome. Um, which the Rode Video Mic Pro requires those batteries that it's just you don't need. Like it's around the same sound quality. I mean, obviously it's a little bit better. There's different modes you can go to. But if you're starting out on YouTube and you really don't want to spend that extra hundred dollars or how many dollars it is. Um, just go with this. I mean, this this is a great mic. I've I've listened to a bunch of stuff for this, and uh, um, I would recommend getting a windscreen. That's what I'm going to be doing. And uh, yeah, it comes with just a wire. And uh, here's just the box had all this in there, just right in there. So uh, yeah, that's pretty awesome. And wow, nothing else to take it out. So ooh, this is nice. Okay, here's the actual microphone. Um, I'm going to just go through a little bit of this because I always wanted to hear what the people said and they never said. This is like a squishy, it's like a, I don't know, it's it's really, 
it's, I don't know, it's hard to explain what this material feels like. Uh, it says road right there, as you can kind of see, and then this part is a, uh, it's like a, a plastic, this red is plastic, um, this is plastic on the bottom as well. Uh, here's the hot shoe right there, so uh, you put that right on the top of your camera. Here's the part where you plug in the, um, right where that little hole is right there, that's where you put in the wire which comes right here with the uh, instruction manual, I believe, right here, which I'm not going to look at because it's plugging in one wire to another wire. It shouldn't be that hard. Um, but I believe after you plug it in, it should just work right away. So uh, we'll test it out uh, with, uh, with and without the video might go thing. But um, a lot of people, um, I was always wondering this too, if you were going to get a, uh, if you were going to get a windscreen, all you gotta do is take that part off and just place the windscreen on there. Um, it does not come with one of these things, so um, that's why it's so cheap. But uh, here is just this thing. Um, it's, I mean, it's not going to come off, I don't think, if I do that. It's it's pretty, it stays on there, and I wish it's together, because I always kind of worried about that, if it was actually going to stay on there. Um, it looks pretty durable. I wouldn't want to drop it very hard, but um, I think it'll stay pretty good. I don't know what else you would want to be doing with that, but um, I, I think that it would be pretty good for... Um, all that so um yeah let's get to the uh, camera unboxing I'm super excited I'm gonna take this out a little wiring here this is what the wire looks like you can stretch a little bit longer it stretches pretty long actually and uh, it doesn't matter which side you plug in to the camera or the microphone it doesn't matter I think you just plug it into either one it does they're both the exact same thing and they do the exact same thing so uh, yeah let's get to the camera unboxing this is an intense moment there's no tape Awesome. Ooh, I am stoked, guys. Okay, so we got some instruction. No, this is just showing like a bunch of stuff. Um, here's one of the instruction manuals. Um, there's a lot of writing and stuff in there that they had to go. Uh, if you ever want to learn a little bit more about the camera, um, I'd researched before, but that's just like, giving you a little bit better example. Here's a DVD disc um, that just lets you do like just see how to set it up and just make sure you know what you're doing before you start doing it for promotion thing I don't know what that is but all right so let's show you a little bit better view of that oh that is awesome here's just a little bit better so we got the camera strap I will not be using because I'll be vlogging but I'm I'm gonna keep this in the package because I will not be using this as much as uh, most people do I will be doing photography but not that much so I'm just gonna be keeping that to the side I will use that though um, Next, we got the kit 18 to 55 millimeter lens. I'm gonna take that out of the bubble wrap here, bubble wrap first. And there's a little bit of a plastic covering. And we got the 18 to 55 millimeter lens. Um, it zooms in and out that far. It's got a focus ring on the top right there. And then it's got the uh, two things right there. You can see that gets off there. I'm gonna put that back on there. Make sure I don't scuff up stuff. So there, right there, you put that back on there. And I know how to put on the actual lens. Most people don't, which is kind of funny because, I don't know. <laughs> here is a uh, micro USB uh, cord right here to plug into the camera and to your computer, straight to your computer. So you don't have to put the SD card in your computer if it doesn't have one or whatever. Uh, just another way to connect um, with the world. You can put this in your computer and stuff like that. Awesome, awesome thing they included. Here is one battery. Uh, it's got the little plastic thing on the bottom there. Um, I know they don't come charged. They come a little bit charged, but I'm going to charge this right now so that um, I can actually show you the camera on. So I'm going to take this out, uh, show you the charger first. Comes in bubble wrap as well. It's a pretty big charger. I mean, most people say it's pretty small, but compared to my other one, my other one for my other Canon is this big. It's a little uh, point and shoot. And um, it's not that much bigger, but it's significantly bigger. So um, battery just goes in like I think whatever way it goes in. It'll have an arrow, but um, this one actually goes, flips the thing out so you can travel with it better. Flip it back in, flip it back out. I'm gonna charge this really quick um, and uh, then I'll finish unboxing this. All right, we're gonna continue this unboxing. I let the battery charge for just a little bit longer, like 10, 15 minutes or something like that. I don't have a lot of time, so I gotta, just kind of go with it. All right, we're going to get the body of the actual camera out. So the actual camera itself with the flip out screen, Canon T6i body. Here it is in my hands, my own Canon T6i. This feels awesome. It's got that nice bubble wrap around it. It smells new. Um, 
grab. I don't know what this is. It's like a cloth, I guess. And then open it up. There it is. There it is, guys. There is the actual camera itself. Well, a couple different angles here. Got that nice flip out screen here. The little thumb hole right here so you can actually put your finger in there to flip it out. And it'll flip back around like that. You can hold it like that. It comes off the right or the left side depending on how you look at it. Um, but where that T6i part is, that's where the flip out screen is going to be. Put that back in there so it's safe. Um, the These two little holes right here, these little metal things right there are for the camera strap. This uh, little metal part up here is for the hot shoe for the microphone so the microphone will slide up into the hot shoe like through this little part here but I'll show you that later. Um, this has a bunch of different functions up there if you want to pause the video. See all those little functions there. Um, it is touchscreen as a touchscreen camera, which is awesome because that's that's pretty that's pretty cool to have a touchscreen camera. Um, and uh, it's got a little bit of more buttons too. There's the trash trash one and stuff like that. Menu. Here's the viewfinder right here. Better view of that. Um, this is where you actually put the lens on. This is the button to take pictures. Um, this will be the button to record and stop recording. I'm gonna flip this around so I don't mess around with that. Um, this is where you put the microphone uh, right there. It says mic. I don't know if you guys can see that. Right there. Um, that's where you put the microphone thing in. There's the HDMI. Um, I think the other side has the card for the card opener. That's where you put your SD card. Little slot right there. The battery is on the bottom. You put the battery in right, right there, and it'll go in this way, I believe. Just kidding. That way. Just kidding. It will go in this way. Yeah, there we go. I was right the first time. Okay. Close that. Um, to get the, this thing off, and you just twist it. So you just twist that little piece right there. I'm going to put the lens on. So um, take this little piece off the lens. Um, find the white part right there. There's a little white dot. There's a little red dot right there. Line those two up on this thing. Just gonna place it in there. And then you twist this until you hear a click. And I clicked it, you hear that? Um, so now the uh, lens is on the camera. This is what it looks like with the lens on from a side angle, front angle, different side angle back will look exactly the same so um, it is a little bit heavy with the uh, lens on there but if I take the lens cap off here that that's what it'll look like if I have it flipped out screen that's what it'll look like um, with all that stuff um, it is a it is not a uh, full 360 rotation that's as far as it'll go um, I'm not sure what it is but it doesn't go all the way around so um, you can't just keep flipping and flipping and flipping it so um, I'm going to put the um, microphone on and um, yeah, we'll test out the camera a little bit. All right, so I'm going to be putting the uh, microphone on here. Um, all you have to do is just place it in this little part like I said, and then just start twisting until it seems a little bit tight there, so it'll be right on there. Um, it looks really, really good with the uh, this thing on there. Um, and let's plug in the, uh, oh, by the way, the screen actually does click when it goes in, so you know it's actually and the thing. Let's get the uh, these two things that plug into the back. There we go. Plug. You have to plug in a couple, a little bit harder than I thought, but open that up right there. Plug in the other cord into the microphone cord port right here. I'll show you that in a second. This part's hanging out a little bit, but uh, you plug in it right there, so it should look like this. Um, and you can move it and this flip out screen actually does interfere with that I believe so you have to put it around you have to kind of adjust it um, based on what you're doing here so um, this is uh, getting in the way a little bit you just have to kind of figure out how you're gonna make it work I wish they'd fix that a little bit better because it's kind of annoying um, but I'm going to be turning the camera on here and uh, 
showing all of you what it looks like. So the on switch, there's an off, on, and then camera switch. So let's turn it to video. I mean video, that's what I meant. There, that's what it looks like right there. Um, I'm gonna set up this really quick. Um, it's just like the basic things and I'll get back to you. I'm going to be putting the SD card in there. So I'm gonna be just opening that really quick. Um, so yeah, there's just a little bit to set up. It's really easy unboxing opening for this little SD card. You just rip it and open. Um, this is what it looks like when you open it there. Uh, I will be getting extra batteries for this camera. Um, not Canon batteries, but like an off-brand. I think it's Wasabi Power. Wasabi Power is about 30 bucks cheaper, so if you do want to just get a little bit, it's the, basically the same thing, it's just you're buying for the brand. So um, I'm getting a cheaper version of it, and it comes with a charger and stuff for like 30 bucks. Two batteries, charger, really good. Um, I'll leave all the this camera and stuff in the link um, to the in the description. Here's the SD card. Just a normal SD card. Um, you can pause the video if you want to see a little bit better. Um, but to open it, a little card open right here, place it in way got it first try let's go there we go and it does that little red thing um, and hopefully there we go all right there it is um, showing it's really HD like you really can't show in this camcorder because I'm not using my actual vlog camera but this is what it looks like um, I'm actually going to switch it does shut off after a little bit I'm gonna switch to this camera and test it out just a little bit all right so there's zoom in quality there um, door, it's pretty far away as you can kind of see. I really like this camera so far. Hope you guys all enjoy the sound quality. I don't know what it sounds like right now. Uh, I'm loving this setup though. I will be getting a tripod for this. I'm actually holding it with my hand right now. I will show you what it looks like in the mirror right now though. First, my family just got home. Um, I'm, gonna sh I'm gonna get the reactions with this camera. Family of the Ashelmans, how would you like to see the brand Whoa. new camera? Is that the new microphone? Yeah. D shoes. I want to see what kind of picture it takes. Zooming in, zooming out. Up off screen. So That's how I'm going to be holding video. it for vlogging. There's Isabel. Oh my gosh. Low light, better light. Here's what it looks like in the actual mirror. This looks so sweet, guys. Like, just looking at this in the mirror, dude, this is legit. I love this thing already so much. It looks like completely open here. I'm gonna zoom in. But on that note, I'm going to be ending this video here. Um, so, if you enjoyed this unboxing video and you want to see more videos with this camera, hit that subscribe button. I will be doing a lot more of these videos with this camera. This is my new vlog camera. I used to use my little point and shoot right here. This is my main vlogging camera right now. I'm not really sure if I, yeah, there you go. Um, it shoots in 1080, but this is like 10 times better. I will be using this for more um, than just vlogging. If you have any questions, definitely let me know in the comments. Um, this camera was $750, um, or no, it was $800, but I got it for $750 on sale on Black Friday, um, including tax. So um, if you guys all did enjoy, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys all next time. I'm going to be doing the this.